Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and back to another weekend in my life vlog. This weekend we are actually in Massanutten, which is a little ski resort area right outside of Harrisonburg, Virginia. And that's actually where my little brother goes to college. So we're here with Matt's family, just gonna have a fun little ski weekend and weekend in the woods, in the mountains. And I'm really excited. Um, so I'm just gonna bring you guys along and have some fun, just like quality family time. It's actually Matt and I's first time skiing, so I'm really excited, but it's just gonna be a fun little weekend. So I'm gonna bring you guys along and let's go. Guys, this little area is so cute. So many cute little cabins. And here's our little house for the weekend. You excited? You walked in with your hands empty? <laughs> kind of. I'm coming. So cute. Look how cute our room is. I love this. And yes, I'm sitting here eating a slice of pizza before dinner because I'm starved. But it's so cute in here. So we are off to go ice skating and get dinner. I'm really excited. I love ice skating. Got my hat, my gloves, all the stuff I need ready. And here we go. How cute. I'm excited. and dinner it was fun we just did like a quick burger type situation for dinner because we only had like an hour and now we're back we went ice skating had some fun cold <laughs> I threw my I hair tumble. Matt fell pretty bad I asked him to take a picture with me and then she and table went, taught me she <laughs> said know. here move and then she put her foot behind me and I went I leaned in and I <laughs> fell right on my back it was so bad I actually fell wrist. too right in the beginning I like went to turn around to skate backwards and just kind of fell forward a little, but caught myself, it wasn't like a hard fall, but I haven't been skating in years, so it was fun. And I'm really still nervous for tomorrow though, let me tell you. I've never been skiing. We've both, ne both never been skiing before. Just a little nervous. So I think I'm going to change out. I have literally two- Are you flashing your bed? <laughs> I have um, thermal leggings on and uh, sweatpants, and I got really hot skating. I took my coat off, but I think I'm gonna kind of do the same thing tomorrow. Like, I don't, I don't know. My ski pants are kind of on the tighter side. They're my dad's, fun fact, and they're tight on me. So um, I think, I don't really know the plan for tomorrow, but I think we're gonna play some games now and just chill. The rest of his family is coming at like 10 tonight, so in a few hours. But until then, we'll probably just play some games, hang out, really drink a little. Yeah, they said they'll be here at 10. They like just left. Just. So gonna hang out with the fam and Play some games. Poor Frank was left alone all the few hours, and like tomorrow is gonna be a long day. It's eight hours of skiing, and I really don't think I'm gonna last eight hours skiing. I just my first time skiing. I could just imagine me falling, well, not wanting to do it. <laughs> I know. Is the other dog the coming? Dog. Oh, no problem. Okay. Well, time to go hang. <laughs> Hi, Frankie. Did you like this house all by yourself? Yeah, Did you like it? Yeah, yeah. Get out my way. I took a picture of it. It's on my phone if you want to open it up. Yeah. Um, so Dude, where's your phone? Matt's already in bed behind me. It should be on the bed somewhere in there. Um, trying to get the Wi-Fi together. But we played this game called Boo Ray. Is that what it's called? Boo Ray? Boo Ray. Boo Ray for the past few hours. And I was pretty lousy at first, but I actually did decent this last round. I didn't lose any money. I didn't win money, but I didn't lose any either. I was being a little too conservative, I think. But now it is time to go to bed. I got my pajamas on and Matt's already in bed. It's after midnight, which is like well past my bedtime and I'm sleepy. So we're going to wake up around eight tomorrow and try to hit the 
the slopes <laughs> by nine and we have eight consecutive hours so we'll be skiing literally all day i don't know how i'm gonna manage that i probably won't want to stay all day long to be honest but off to bed and we will see you guys in the morning got both the boys in bed now i think this bed's a little too high for frankie to jump on so hopefully he doesn't try to jump up at night because this whole contraption but time to hit it right frankie are you ready for bad mommies he keeps hearing people outside and he's like i want to see what's going on out there i just want to see what's going on good morning guys it is almost nine o'clock on saturday and we are getting ready for skiing i'm just gonna put a lot um pair of leggings on under my ski pants because it is almost 50 degrees out today so pretty warm i don't want to be like overheating but i'm starting to panic everyone was telling like stories this morning about how they have a friend that died skiing and all this crazy stuff and i'm like i'm not gonna be okay <laughs> but hopefully all is well and i like am not too sucky at this but who knows and i don't know so i'm wearing this walmart long sleeve tee these are like eight dollars at walmart and they are the best i have them in every single color and then i'm just wearing a pair and then I'm just wearing a pair of little thermal leggings that go up really high. So, that is the outfit. I'm going to throw some extra socks on. I have two pairs of ski pants. I have to try what one I want to wear on because my dad's, I have my mom's and my dad's old ones. And honestly, my dad's are tighter on me than my mom's. And then I have my mom's old ski jacket too. So, this is like fun. I feel like this is like vintage-y and like, I don't know. I just like it. So, time to finish bundling up and then we're gonna hit it. Already. On our way to the ski resort. I'm really nervous. I'm about to die. I'm nervous. Mike's telling me stories about how his friends freaking ride right into trees and trying to make me feel better about it or something. It's fun. <laughs> Hopefully I don't suck. I had to braid my hair because I just know my hair is gonna not. I have the most fine hair. And if it's down with like a coat, it's just gonna be bad news. So, got some braids. Going to the ski resort, we're in technically like Massanutten Resort area. So, we don't have that far to drive. I think it's like five more minutes, so. Ready, Matt? What? Ready, Tom? <laughs> Zip line! I'm really panicking. Really nervous. <laughs> what? The worst part is getting off the end of this thing, Bob. You gonna Made it down two times without falling. I was going like a speed race. <laughs> this helmet is so funny. I can't. It's <laughs> easier to love it. It's you by my side. Shining through the cracks like the first one in life. Feeling like a child. It's when I'm like the shovels. How was your experience, Matt? I had a blast and I did great. He's been bragging the whole day. Until my last run. That he is the best skier in the world. My last run, I lost my skis and my poles. <laughs> and my one ski <laughs> went flying down and destroyed some dude. Yeah, so. Everyone on the ski lift was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so what we did, we did two Green Hills to start. And this was both of our first time skiing and I was not ready to go up to a blue hill, but they forced me to. And I wiped out twice pretty good on that blue hill. And then I went back to the greens for a little bit and then got some courage to go back to a blue hill. I wiped out again. And then we went to a different blue hill and I wiped out real bad twice on that one. That one was like straight down blue hill. It was terrifying. <laughs> not my favorite sport. I'm happy I tried it, but it's like I'm not, I'm not you eager to go back. I don't think I was necessarily bad, but it was like giving me anxiety. Like I was like, my heart was racing. Like I did not like, I don't know if I liked it. So, well, I definitely... <laughs> I like the greens. I want there to be like a longer green hill where it's not like straight down, more like leisurely, like, but long because I feel like the green hills were so short, but I think that's more my speed, you know? <laughs> so we're actually getting ready for dinner now. We, um, I got back like maybe 40 minutes ago. Matt got back like 15 minutes ago. I really only went Showered up on the hill. I just put yeah. it in the line and like we went yeah. down and yeah, Matt went up one extra hill with Mike. Um, the rest of us kind of came home and showered up. Now we're getting ready for dinner. We're going actually into Harrisonburg for dinner, which is where JMU is, and my brother goes to college at JMU. 
So we're trying to meet up with him for dinner, but he's not answering the phone. So who knows if he'll actually show up for us, but that is the plan, I guess. Gonna go to a buffet, because Matt talks about this buffet all the freaking time. No, I don't. <laughs> when he I went to a, a football camp, good. he went to a football camp at the, like, and then they no, went to the buffet. Official visit oh, they're his, his official visit at JMU for football, and then they went to this buffet, and he like loves it. So hopefully it's good because I'm not really a buffet gal. Don't really know many buffets that I've ever been to, so I'll test it we out and see. For breakfast, um, yeah, so, so yeah, I'm gonna put a little bit of makeup on, and then we're gonna head to the beach. Okay. We're on our way to Harrisonburg for dinner. We're going to a buffet. Like, I think I should mention it. For a real me. fancy thing. <laughs> Never been to, I don't think I've ever been to a buffet. I don't think. I've been to some buffets. Um, if I have, it's been a freaking long time. They're called buffets. A buffet. So the fancy but people we're say. about to call my family to tell them how we did and how we fared skiing. My dad really likes skiing. What, is it, are we too washed out? Oh, I'm really red. I know, I think we got a little bit burned. Um, this road is crazy, but my brother was supposed to meet us and go to dinner with us, and he texted me. He texted me, he goes, I'm at a party. This is a really scary road. <laughs> okay, he goes, I'm at a party. I'm really banged up right now. What time are we going to dinner? I was like, we're leaving now. So if you're too banged up, then I mean, I'll see you later. Like, early, I'm not gonna see but you. It's everyone it's five everyone's hungry because so. we haven't eaten all day. Yeah. And we're skiing. Yeah, and obviously we're not going to wait on my brother. It's like not a big deal if he doesn't come. Maybe I'll, I'll stop we'll by after, after if he's home or something. I don't know. I don't want him driving to the buffet either. So No, he definitely if can't. He's if he's not too been drinking. banged up, maybe we can pick him up if he like, feels okay but just can't mm -hmm. drive. or We'll figure it out. I'll call him. I'll call my parents. Um, you can give him a ride over to the cookout. Yeah driving back um, but my body is aching like aching aching I can barely move <laughs> tomorrow getting out of bed is gonna it be feels the worst similar thing ever. like I'm really sore but I also feel similar to like when you're in the ocean all day and then like you're like well, moving you're with in the water the ocean all day we literally were skiing for I eight am. hours I think that is a little bit too long to do that especially your first time like I don't know I was I was hitting that ground pretty dang hard a few times <laughs> I, I went down. I went down five times wipeout, but on the blue hills. I didn't fall on the green hills, which is good. But the blue hills, not the easiest for me. Not the most coordinated. It was we, the stopping. I was going too fast, and when I like tried to slow down, it work. literally, <laughs> I had no idea what to think. Mike made it seem like it's impossible to ski. Yeah. You guys are going to be falling the whole time. I never fell until the end. Yeah. Like when I was I trying to go really fast down a really like. Then I fell. I flipped yeah. out. But that was like after skiing the thing all day that without falling. Me out on the blue I hills, hit a ramp. I did ramps. Yeah. You fell on that ramp that first time. The Let's first time I went on my <laughs> I went on my butt like but it was like something like that I don't count that as a wipeout. Like I right after is. that I uh I hit the ramps. I hit two in a row. And yeah. Okay. Um so it was fun, but something about the Blue Hills that freaked me out. It was more like panicky problems when I was up there, especially on the one that was like, there was a straight down blue one and then a blue that kind of zigzagged. That one I did better on, but the one that was straight down, like you could just see everything and it looked, it was, it, I almost had a panic attack, I think, on the top of that freaking hill. I easily went 60 plus miles it an was, hour. I was going too fast. I was like, going fast. I could easily get up to speed like that Sarah one went over an edge one time and almost into the yeah i literally almost that's what i was gonna say about the blue hills well they had a net but you almost there went it into did the luckily net. but you wouldn't have it wouldn't have been like but a lot of them you would didn't have, have nets. stopped like in leaves or something like matt that's what i was gonna say was scary about the blues though is because they there were some there rocky was just, like, areas cliffs. that's like, why you had to stay away from like if i went a few feet to the right I would have fell, fallen off a freaking thousand no, but foot as, cliff. As I said, <laughs> was, when I first started, terrifying. after we got off the first ski lift, I said, all I'm gonna do is just pretend like I'm in the Olympics. Like I know what I'm doing, yeah. watch. And then I, I literally saw some guy go down pretty fast. And then I just followed right behind him and just was watching his skis that trying to do that. And I was like, I was like, this is actually way easier than I thought. He's the most cocky mofo in the world. It was way easier than 
expecting. So if you don't think that you want to ski, just go do it because it's really easy. I wish there were more green hills that were like long, like that blue one, but not so steep. Like I want like, lo like yeah, long, the like one blue one was fine. green hills because that's just more fun for me. But the one blue one. The one blue was, was okay. Literally like a black diamond, so it was sort of like. Just, I've never been on a black, so I wouldn't know. You could but see them there, right next. They to were them. like identical, so I don't know what differs from the black to the blue besides the difficulty. I don't know if there's more, like there weren't moguls on the blue, and that's why it would be less difficult. I don't really know, but it felt like it was freaking straight down, so it was pretty scary for me. You guys have to see this view. Look at this. How gorgeous! Can you guys tell? How beautiful is that? Oh my gosh. Do you want to film a little of the Yeah, of you're going to crush us. <laughs> how pretty. Wow, I would live down here again. I really would. Again, as if you ever lived here. We lived an hour from here. Two nice hours. At Fox. Go down, not wipe out. My bad. We just got back to our little cabin. We went to visit my brother at his campus and honestly didn't stay all that long because he's in college and honestly we didn't have much to talk about. We talked about skiing for a little and that stuff and then I grabbed myself a Diet Coke and we drove back and it's just about eight o'clock. We're probably gonna play more games with the fam and have a fun little night. Wait, wait. 